The game is, how many bales are we going to make from there? We've put muck on it, we've put till on it, we've put everything on it. You guys who do really short cuts are going to absolutely hate this field. This is going to test them alone. Ah, it's there. Boom, found it. I need you. Oh, hello. I think I just got a blue in my face. Tom, why don't you put a hole in it? Because then when I want to go fill it up again, there's a hole in the bottom. We fill it from a big blue drum uh, next door who have got a big tub of it because who knows how long this tractor is going to be here. So don't really want to buy 200 liters. There we go. Good job. Just before we start this video, it is the day before my birthday. So it is Penny's birthday today. Penny is 30 and she's not just really fat, she's actually pregnant. <laughs> so she is seven months pregnant today. So can we all just say happy birthday, Penny? Thanks guys. There we go. <laughs> Hopefully they say in the comment section, if they're not, that's cruel. And also we have TP merch, which is here. I'm sporting the TP merch, wrong color for farming, but it's gonna get dirty, so might as well wear it today. Um, so you can get it at this link here. Right, let's go work. Ah, uh, you might have noticed. We have the new stickers up there. We have the Farm Life t-shirts. We have two other t-shirts. We have two hoodies coming out, a vest. We have mugs, we have key rings. Oh, beeping. We have lanyards. We have so much stuff going on. It's very, very exciting. So if you did pick it up, thank you very much. If it didn't sell at all, oops. <laughs> right, I can tell my dad's been on this. There we go. Good morning everyone, it is actually morning, I'm doing quite well. If you have not already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, ring a little bell, but to get notifications on my videos every Tuesday, Friday, and the other occasion we do the Sunday video. Oh, a Pemberton's truck, just about to pass. A little bit different, obviously we've got the mower on the back, and we're gonna hit those. We are going on mowing a gold field, we are mowing the 40 acres that we have over there, which are first cut. Um, so the second first cut, if that makes sense, the second farm that we have, we're mowing over there and we are mowing a gold field today. Because of COVID-19, they let it grow a bit too long and they've just asked us, can we mow it off for them? And obviously, us being nice guys, we will mow it off for them. Uh, will we make some big bales out of it? No idea. I haven't even looked at the crop and what it looks like. Excited to be mowing something different. It's always nice to be doing different things. So that's what we're getting on with now. Only about four acres, Dad said, so it shouldn't take, should take me about 25 minutes with this mower, but I'm gonna guess it's gonna be a lot of fiddling. We didn't know if we were gonna mow today because it was raining this morning. So obviously when it starts raining, we decided that might as well start mowing. That makes sense, doesn't it? It's classic Pemberton's. I don't know if anyone else is like that, but we are. Contractors are coming tomorrow, which is my birthday. Nice birthday present for me to go shopping. Uh, they're gonna come, they've got 50 acres to do in the morning, and then they're gonna come tomorrow afternoon so that's what I'm gonna be doing haven't told my beautiful girlfriend yet she's gonna be excited for that one I think she's got something planned but those plans are gonna have to change we are here I'm hoping it's going to be nice and easy to get in not always the case with some things and oh the gates open oh very nice of them I know I said it in the last video this mower, when you've got grips to it, even me, even me, is nice and easy. Dad went rolling in this field when it was really dry, left the back door open, it has air con, you don't need to do that, and it's very dusty in here now. So Tom needs to clean it. Thanks Dad. Appreciate it mate, pal. Okay, let's put a few revs on. Oh, maybe. Mowing, so they're gonna have muck in it. So he's gonna, he's 
going to big bail it tomorrow. So there's not a lot in it at all. I'd, I'd be surprised. Five big bales in it. It's free grass, which could be very important by the end of uh, end of this year, looking at everything. So I'll get this whacked up, and then we'll go to the proper field, the big field, and uh, the molehill, because that stuff is stuff. Thing. Right, so I'm gonna play a little bit of a game. she be alright. We're obviously gonna have some big bales from this field. In some spots, it's there is no grass, not no grass at all. But in some spots, it's a bit of grass, you know. It's not actually. Yeah. Like I was saying before, this year might be a bad year for grass growing. It's a bad year for straw, definitely. Spoken to with the person that we get straw off already, and they've said, don't expect a lot. Um, so this. I don't know how many bales. Do we play a game? Tell you what, it's quite funny though. <laughs> That's what Dad was doing when he was watching me mow golf balls. The game is how many bales are we going to make from there? I'm going to go quite short. I'm going to guess 10. So if you put in the comment section how many bales you think we're going to get from this area, you can kind of see it. If my drone doesn't die, I'll get a good picture from above. Like it's, there's like bits and then over there there's nothing. So we'll play the game. No, I'm going to go eight. Eight bales. How many bales do you think we should do? You guess. I don't know how many dad's gonna think. I'll try and ask him at the end of the video. Whoever guesses first gets major brownie points and you win. Right, let's get drawn because it's falling down. Woo! Yeah, so I don't know what the best time you is. Some people down south will go that field. Not us. Oh, you, I forgot. You're about to see a field. Holy moly. Chop this little bit so we could chip the dry cows out in the highlands. The highlands are still here, they haven't met Abel yet. There's not loads of grub up here, there's this bit of track and the track all the way up there. It's quite good for dry cows, you don't want to feed them too much. All they want to do is just keep maintain their body weight. Some of them are, well all of them are quite, some of them are a little bit conditioned. You know, we're all a little bit conditioned, we're all a bit quite big. But they're, they're, they're happy here. Might start using that feed trailer maybe give a bale of straw because that's all they want they just want the belly full i just want to make sure they've got grub i'm gonna get into the next field and we are gonna get mo pig you're gonna see two different crops we've done that field there which eight bales eight bales of salon and now this field hasn't been done anything we've put muck on it we've put till on it we've put everything on it do i go in that gateway why did i come through this gateway doesn't make any sense. Stupid boy Tom. Hey, I'm excited to get in here. We'll have a walk through in a minute and show the difference between crops. <laughs> because there is a large difference. Oh, you guys who do really short cuts are gonna absolutely hate this field. Right, so the game in this field is two manholes and then the other one is a gas main. So if you, that's what you've got to avoid when you're mowing this field. Forward a little bit, let's be in a bit of grass, Thomas. This is going to test them alone. B5, B6 is going to make it squeal.
She was mowing really, really well, really nicely. I thought, wow, oh, this is great. And then a lot of muck started coming up. So you see here, you see that? Now that has got to be the muck that we put on a while ago and it's just not rotted through. See that? Which is 100 million billion percent. Not what I want in the grass. So what I'm going to do is, I've just checked that. It's mowing nicely. I just jumped out and checked, see, mowing nicely all across that's good that's what we want but i feel like it's digging in a little bit long a little bit too much all we do is just lengthen this so it's gonna bring the nose up a little bit that would probably do so i'm just gonna mow it a little bit shorter so it doesn't get any muck that's my plan try that so what's happened there, if you don't know, on a three-point link, is just extend the top end and then it will push it up so it should mow it a little bit nicer, I'm hoping. This field, we did put a lot of box muck in and uh, I don't want it to come back in the grass at all. It's going to do another run of about 20 yards, double check it, turn her on, revs off, let's have a look. So the sides was fine. Like I don't think there's much muck there, but here I think there's more muck. So we don't want to just cut it a little bit shorter. It should encourage regrowth a bit better as well. Is that moan? Um, that's not moan. Why is that not moan? Check another area. So if you can see that, so that's the length of the grass I'm leaving now. Length of the grass I was leaving, a lot shorter. I think I've pulled it back too much here. Funny how it's changed. Went around the whole time, no problem. What I'm going to do is just short one turn. I was going to short it too, but one turn should do. There we go. And that should be a lot better. Two runs, but went really nicely. And just there, just started picking up a lot of more. I wasn't happy. I'm going to do a, I'm going to do a full run. See what she's like at top speed. Plan it. I was mowing at is that is that a true representation of not mowing at my top speed now just about 15k which is incredible by the way it's a lot it's starting it's nothing but I want to make sure I'm right so we'll be able to just see the difference see this muck there it's what we don't want in don't want that muck in there's a little bit of length on there. See that? A little bit of length there. Issues about putting muck on late. But that's a lot better. I'm happy with the way that's mowing. I'll give Dad a bell just to make sure that he's happy because he'll definitely want to put a two pennies in. <sighs> right, let's actually crack on. That's what you're going to do when you don't know where the manhole cover is. You've got to make sure you do not hit that manhole cover. Believe me. I've not done it yet, and I do not want to make a video of it at all. Ah, it's there. Boom, found it. Woohoo! It's there, it's in it. That's good. Got it. That makes me happy when skies are grey. Absolutely mint in this field. Love it. Yeah, I went in that gateway. I'd, I'd have gone in that one. I just, you know, it's just force of habit. I just thought. I'd have gone in there. What's this stuff like? Uh, not as thick as it is. No, it looks great when you mow it, yeah. but it's not a lot in it. You, you mow it close enough there, I think. So the first two runs yeah. Yeah. was the first time, and then a, a yeah. third or fourth run on here, because it's a bit, it's a bit cob. And I'm just slowing down here as well. Yeah. Just because if there's anything here, yeah. I don't want to smack it. Yeah. Um, yeah, this is, it looks great when you mow it. There's nothing in it. Oh, no. It's had no muck on, it's had nothing on for years, 20 years. It no. just shows you it's lost all its fertility. Yeah. Even though you put in um, fertilizer. But it'll get some muck this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can just see, I think it was, the muck was 
put on too heavily over there, you can see it. It's coming back a bit. Yeah, it's yeah. coming back a bit. That's why that's yeah. where I lifted yeah. it and I yeah. thought. I think you've already tightened it tight enough because it, it, it'll, it'll come better second time. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's, it's going to be wide under here. Dad has jumped in, we've just had a little bit of a chat there. This little field here is where we reseeded, and you said it looks like a field of barley, yeah? Yeah, it's look at all the seed heads here. It's, uh, it's not been forced at all, and uh, unfortunately it's lost because it's been game crop, cover crop area for 20 years, and it's had nothing put on it, it's only 10 now. It's lost its natural fertility, and it's on top of the hill, and chances are, if it needs some muck in it, he wants to get the earthworms going, it needs yeah. feeding. And, it just uh, needs a few years, doesn't it? Yeah. But it will be good, but it's dying on its feet, it wants yeah. getting off. And, and it's going to rain on Wednesday, and so... And it's going to pour out on Wednesday. It can't, it can't hurt yeah. those bit of muck that yeah. stay. So that's why we've gone. It's completely different to the first little field we did at the golf course. Absolutely. Completely different. Um, so I was having a bit of a debate. I've hit some golf balls, by the way. I had a bit of a debate in the first field. In the first field, I finished it off. And I reckon we're going to get eight big bales from it. There's a bit more grass in places. Yeah. Eight big bales, what do you reckon? How many oh. big bales? Um, you haven't seen it chop, bone. Oh, no, I'm not agree with you, it might be 10. 10, yeah, I went with 10 to start with, to be honest. Well, I yeah. found where the manhole is as well. There, there. One more run, one more run, your run, because I'm going to jump out. Yeah, I think it was here, you can just see, I like, just getting some muck up and I wasn't very happy with it. So. It's making it bark a little bit, you know, just there, didn't it? Yeah, it's, it's very heavy here, it's very tight sworn. We did that with our JF last year. Oh uh, yeah, I remember you saying. I was away, wasn't I? Doing yeah. something. The belt was the belt was slipping on the JF when I was doing the JF, and uh, because of the pressure, it's very very tight sward. A lot of grass for a little area. A little grass for a little area. Go down, go down. Is it too too fast? Too fast. Do it though. Yeah, you'll do it, but I'd rather keep the stomach where it belongs. <laughs> right, father. I shall let you take over. of today's video and what an absolute beautiful way to end the video i think it's about 20 past six now dad's just right behind me he's literally got these last little bits to do the mower absolutely smashed it the tractor is just 
it's just so easy. The only thing with the mower on up there on the flat, you see the flat there. Uh, wasn't used locking nuts so what happens is the nuts actually came out see this field is there's a bit of grass on it there's not loads it's had till it's had slurry it's had box muck and just doesn't seem to grow too well it's it's all right it's not the biggest crop in the world but then it just goes to head so going to head is the seeds there same is that field over there that we've got the beef stock in this time we had these fields we mowed that one with the beef stock in first and second cut second cut we got six trailers off and it's about four to uh, twelve acre field so after we did that we said no way because it's it's so hard to mow and it's such a it's a bad little field that i don't really get it ours grow really well i think the amount we've put on over time in the soil is loads but i think everyone's in the same boat when you look at any of the forums you talk to anyone everyone sounds like they're in the same boat and this whole grass growing hopefully fingers crossed we'll have enough i want to do second cutting here but this is obviously our first dad wants he doesn't want to do second cut in here. He only wants to do first cut in here and start grazing because cows are getting a bit short. If we have a bit of rain, it, we could change what we're doing just because grass might grow underneath them, which would be great. Who knows? I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, my, I, I felt like I was a little bit distracted today. Organizing some stuff. TP merch goes live tomorrow. So, so this stuff, yes please, goes live tomorrow. You guys will know if it went well. Fingers crossed it did. If it, you guys did buy something, I really do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Uh, if you didn't, that's okay as well. I've had a great day today. Go home, sort some website stuff ready for tomorrow, edit a video, and uh, tomorrow is a birthday, so we'll um, chop in the afternoon. Showed some plans for us, but I think we're gonna be siloing instead, so we're gonna move those plans to Wednesday, which is no problem. Guys, thank you very much for watching the video. I really do appreciate it. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to YouTube channel. You get your TP merch at pemtusfarmshop.co.uk slash TP merch. Hope you had a great day. Good crops. See what it's like tomorrow. Well, in the next video for you. See you in a bit. Bye.